Does it look like my back touches the chair? Because it's... It's really never touching. This is probably bad posture. I know. So you're alright guys, Rapis Calplex here. And I'm trick lining in a different spot. I realised that as I was editing last week's video, and as friends told me, I trick line in the same location three times in a row. Well, I'm clever. Everything is ending right now. No, 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 no. I don't mean that like the world is ending. Oh, no, don't, don't have an existential crisis right now, please. But school's coming to an end. Summer holidays here. Spring break, is that what we call it in America? Vacation, that sort of thing. So school's ended, work's probably, if you're at work, you're still at work. If, and with me, college has ended. My college hasn't really like closed down or anything yet, but I finished my course. My two year course has been completed. And oh my God, was it a long and painful and horrible, but enjoyable experience. Don't get me wrong, I enjoyed college. College was always fun. Like learning more about ICT, having more freedom than school. But the big step from school to college is honestly unbelievable. The moment where I, in my school, you weren't allowed to have your phones and you had to hand them in at the beginning of the day and then you would collect them at the end of the day. Back college, you keep your phone on you. You're more responsible for your own possessions. In America, I'm not sure with schools because um, as far as I've seen schools is on TV and if it's not a stereotypical thing or not. But some schools, probably in America or most schools, you're wearing just your own clothes in the school most of the time. I should I say that's awesome. You're more free than me who's bloody stuck in school uniform in a tie and long trousers in let's say 30 degree weather. About 70 degrees Fahrenheit weather. And speaking of weather, holy moly has it been hot. Like right now I don't know why my windows are open. That's really stupid of me. Actually no, it's not stupid of me for keeping my windows open. I'm actually keeping my windows closed because it's actually bearable right now. Like it's got colder, which thank you Lord. Thank you. But also it stops all the sound of the cars coming past getting picked up from the mic but also it being colder is so much better for me because i suffer from hay fever and i'm just dying i'm not sure if i sound any different right now but my nose is like completely bunged and it is my fault i am wearing a long t-shirt like why why would i do shirts decide to wear this but i do like this t-shirt it's very nice i'm choosing fashion over what's more comfortable i'm sad <laughs> Was I riding on my skateboard then? I was. <laughs>It's been so hot in the UK recently. I'm not sure if this is in most places around America, but in America, when I went to America at least, in Florida, in the house there was aircon. It's a little vent in the top corner, just or wherever, which spews out lovely, cool, refreshing air into the house. Here in the UK, we've got not really so modern houses. We've got heating, good old heating, but we don't have aircon. So I can tell by right now why my cheeks being so red, but I'm not letting cars go by my house and you can just hear, you hear all noises down my house. It's just cars, people, mice, anything gets picked up by this mic. I don't know, mice? Mice? Really? There's no mice down my house. Why did I say mice? I'm weird, I'm sorry. What did I do? Anyway, what was I saying? Air conditioning. We need it. I swear to God, we need it. It will keep this house nice and cool right now. I will be able to sit in here and chill, relax, and not having to be moist. Of course, with the end of college and all that, the end of college, school, but with the end of school, you have your exams, and I sat my English exams, as you probably know by me mumbling on about them. Like, me doing a GCC English exam hurts. It hurts one. Me doing it twice, it's not nice. Me doing it three times, it's really, I just really fed up with it. Four time, I really could not. My motivation was down low, but I did it. I did it. I got through it. It's all over. Hopefully, forever. I've tried to so hard, oh my gosh. So my first exam, GCC English Hat exam from this year, it went alright. It went okay. Invigilator went in to got it done. Not nothing much there. The second time we had a different invigilator, he was a bit not put it rudely at all. He seemed like a nice guy, but it's just like he was very make he was making the room very tense. <laughs> Like, for example, some people turned up late to their exam, which I would try to personally not do, but sometimes you can't help it. 
your car doesn't start, you got you got traffic beyond belief. But this guy was getting mad at all the people who turned up on time because the people who were late weren't here. My facial reaction was mostly this whenever he was getting mad at us for no reason was what? I think he got mad at someone because... I think he got mad at someone because they put their hand up to ask him a question. Like, they're asking you a question. They're allowed to speak if they're asking you a question. Like, exams are stressful enough, but him... He was making it like 10 times more stressful than it actually was. I, I want to talk a bit about live streams right now. So, you guys know I've been saying that I'll do two live streams this month, or try and do two live streams this month. I never want to make a promise, but I... I've been feeling it, but kind of not feeling it, if you know what I mean. Like, motivation's kind of been there, but then it just kind of dies out pretty quickly. So I may stream once or twice, but I may stream once this month or twice next month, but I'll, I, I've got to try and live stream again sometime soon. Maybe before this video comes out, I don't know. I may get motivation tomorrow to live stream, I don't know. That's a problem with me. I need to have, like, a set scheduled live stream. Like, Sora, Jesus Christ, he's got... Like, my friend Sora, he's got a really good, like, every single, like, schedule when it comes to streaming. Like, he's always just on point when it comes to his streaming schedule. Except for when it comes to me, because he streams when I, I go to bed. Then whilst I'm asleep, he's streaming. Or he starts his stream whilst I'm asleep. And then as soon as I wake up, stream ends. I'm just like, really? Or as I'm... As I get back from doing something, I get into the end of his stream. I'm just like, oh, come on. He does a lot of Destiny stuff, which I'm not sure if I enjoy. I will enjoy Destiny. Although Destiny 2 is coming out, if you are hyped for that. I just really enjoy Sorable because his personality is on point. And... Come on, he's an OG. To say that he was in the Skate 3 community, he found success somewhere else, which is awesome. Like, he loved Destiny, and he always did. He always made, like, side videos on it, till he started getting popular on it. Because Destiny's not dying. Destiny's got Destiny 2 coming out. Skate 3's got EA servers. Like, Mr. I tried holding, like, this open team lobby thing, and I thought, sweet, I'll join him on that. Didn't realise that I either left or got removed somehow from my old team, which I used to be a part of, and the manager for. No biggie, I'll just join someone else's team who I got invited to. Had one invite. Went to accept it, it said this invite is no longer valid, and it deleted itself, so I am now no longer in the skate team. So I can't do online skate lobbies. We can only throw down, not team up. Thanks, yay. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry if it was all over the place or short or whatever. But I've run out of things to talk about and I may even have to do challenge videos or just something like else because Skate 3. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And as always. Again, did not flick there, but whatever. Cue the outro.